Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Tina. Um, today is the House Mouse Collaboration. Yay! House Mouse Collaboration with Tina Kappa and Gracie21. And um, we have a whole group of ladies that are um, doing the House Mouse Collaboration with us. It's once a month, the third Saturday of every month. And I hope that you can get inspired by our projects. I hope you like what we make and you come back and see our video once a month. Um, it's so much fun. Um, so Grace did this uh, House Mouse collaboration last year and uh, she asked me to take it over this year. So um, I agreed to do that. And um, so this month, I want to tell you that we have a guest designer this month. Deb Hawk is joining us. And I will be putting uh, the link to Deb's channel down below underneath all the other collaborators. And if you could go over and check out Deb's channel and um, her project. Um, and hopefully she uh, is going to be with us um, throughout the year. Whenever she has time to do a project, she's going to um, be joining us. So you'll be watching her channel as well. So let me just get started real quick. Um, I used... First of all, I use this cute, adorable little house mail stamp. Um, because it's February, because it's Valentine's Day today, I'm recording this on Valentine's Day. So happy Valentine's Day to everybody. Um, you won't see this till Saturday, but um, anyway. <laughs> I use this cute, adorable little mouse here. And uh, he's reading a love letter. And he has a little gift back here with little hearts all over it. It's so cute, and there's the envelope at the bottom. Now, I'm going to read this real quick. It's so cute, you got to hear this. Dear one, dearest one, there are all the things, these are all the things that I love about you. Your cute little hairy nose, your squeaky voice, your charming scuttles, your speedy, seedy breath, <laughs> and your cheesy jokes. I hope you will be mine forever, XOXO. Isn't that cute? It's just so adorable. I had to use it because it reminded me of Valentine's Day. So this um, is the stamp that I used on one of my projects. I made two projects, you guys. Um, I had this out because I had on one of my cards, I distressed it with that. And I wanted to share that with you guys. This is actually from Close to My Heart. And it has like these sharp metal things in here, in between here. So you can take your paper and rough it up on the edges. Um, so I use this a lot and I got this years and years ago. So I just wanted to share that with you. All right, so let's get started, you guys. I want to share this cute, adorable little card that I made. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, what do you think? So adorable. I love that little mouse. He's so cute. Colored with Copics. I did, um... A few layers here so we have the background paper which I got from my Valentine's uh, loose papers um, I have a stash of loose papers and I pulled that out of there I used the pink doily I cut it in half I got half on this side and half sticking out over here this is the white um, part that I stamped on this is where I roughed the edges now I'm not sure you guys can see the edges but I roughed them up with that um, knife thing and then I stamped that down with uh, my Misty tool and I colored it up with the Copics. And then on the bottom, I used this white um, ribbon and it has this metallic uh, little red hearts. They're shiny and they're like uh, metallic. And I'm not sure if the camera picks that up or not, but it's so pretty. And then at the top, I just cut the paper and I used a Martha Stewart punch and gave it that little decorative edge to put on the top. I love this card. It came out so cute and I was so happy the way the mouse came out too. I should have uh, wrote down the colors I used to, so next time I could use those same colors because I was very happy with the way he turned out. These little mice are hard to color you guys. They really are. Um, I tried different colors and different combos and they're really hard to do but I was very happy with the way he came out. And then these little tiny hearts um, on the bottom here and one up here, those I just, I have a little heart punch and I punch those out and use those. 
So what do you think? Do you like it? I love it. <laughs> so this is the inside. And again, I roughed the edges on that white piece. And then this was a little sticker that I had. I stuck in there. And I used some more of that paper that was on the front. And then I, I think I, yeah, I did stamp the back with my, my um, stamp. So cute. So that was my main um, project. That was what I did. And then I decided to do something extra. So I made this cute little card. And this is actually an envelope. And I decorated the front February 14th. And then on the back, it says just a note. And then I have a little card in here that I made. And this is how cute is that. Now, I do not own the stamp, this stamp with this house mouse. And someone had stamped out a bunch of house mouse things a long time ago and sent me um, some images. And I pulled that out of, the, out of the stash because of the hearts, the I love you. I thought that was perfect for February. I decorated with that um, paper, the heart paper. I put a heart doily in the background. So the heart starts here and goes around this way and this way and then it's underneath. <clears throat> I layered this layer with a little bit of green. This green underneath the white. Now see, this mouse didn't come out as cute colored up. I mean, they still come out cute, but do you see the difference? I don't know if you could tell the difference. But this one to me looks fuzzy, like more fuzzy than this one does. I don't know, maybe it's the image. But I put these little tiny dots with the Copics markers. I just dab little dots at the bottom to make it look like they're standing on like a ground, like sand or gravel. And then I put this cute little hello. This was a stamp and I stamped it on this little green piece. And I added two of those um, sparkly hearts. They have like glitter in them. And then this little card opens this way. And then that's the inside. So these cards, I had gotten these cards and envelopes from uh, my friend in New York. And this was actually like a little, it had a little tab at the top. So it was actually like a file card, a file. Let me see if I have one so I can show it to you guys. I think I have another one. Yep, I have another one. So it, it was like this. You see how this is? And it opens like that. Isn't that cute? And then it comes with an envelope. And then the envelope has like that grid that's on the top of the card. So I decided to use that little thing there to create this card. And all I did was snip the little tab off the top and I decorated the card. And that's why you see the grid on this side because that's what that was. That was like a filing card. And then I took the envelope and just decorated the envelope so my little card can go inside. So those are my two projects for my house mouse collaboration share today. Um, please go, I'll have all the links in the description box down below for all the other collaborators. And I will also have Deb Hawk's um, YouTube channel down below. Please go visit them all and see their house mouse projects for this month. And if you like our videos and you enjoy the House Mouse Collaboration, please come back next month. And just remember, it's the third Saturday of every month. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for visiting. Please thumbs up, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you next month. Bye. Happy Valentine's Day.